Aloha friends, it's Robert Stelic here at the Blue Planet Surf Shop in Haleiwa. I'm really proud to introduce our new Evolution series that we just came out with in 2024. Um, these boards are all new, new design, new construction, new deck pads, really nice boards. Um, we just got a chance to use them this morning, we've got some great footage. And so we're going to talk about the construction, the design, the artwork, and how you can try one out for yourself. Okay, so in this video, I'm going to talk a little bit about the design of these new boards, the construction, and also the features. So I'm really proud of the construction. We got a new factory that's making these boards from us. It's uh, based in Vietnam, but they have a lot of experience making composite boards, um, some of the best in the world. The, these ones have a special carbon layup that's uh, it's like a proprietary layup that allows the board to flex a little bit and be super responsive in the waves when you're loading it up in a turn it'll just be it's super snappy uh, very lightweight like these boards are super light but also quite strong and we actually had a board today that went over the rocks after the leash um, came off and it really got tumbled around on the, on the rocks and had actually minimal damage. So these boards have a high density foam, PVC uh, foam outer shell. So you can think, think of it as a thick outer shell with carbon and uh, you know it's molded, um, heat molded. So the uh, PVC wraps all the way around the rails and uh, that makes the outer shell really strong. So the strength to weight ratio on these boards is excellent. We call this construction smart carbon. It stands for Sandwich Molded Active Response Technology. And that active response uh, refers to our proprietary carbon layup that allows the board to have a nice responsive flex that's really snappy and, and it feels really good and turns on the waves. These boards are excellent boards for surfing, but also we have some models that are better for um, all around surf, surfing and cruising. And then of course also we have the 14 foot bump rider which is an excellent board for downwind racing and just cruising and going fast, especially with the waves in the, in the downwind conditions. So we've developed the surf models over many years. We had many generations of these boards. On these ones, we made some small tweaks to it. We moved the volume slightly more towards the tail. So when you're standing, paddling, you don't have to move back as much to get into the surf stance. So it still uh, has you know, the volume uh, pretty much centered in, in the middle. So um, it's, it's really well balanced out the volume. And then uh, added a little bit more rocker to the nose and to the tail. So it still has a really smooth constant curve rocker but it's a little bit more responsive uh, for turning and carving and so on. And then the, the rails are pretty thinned out here in the back of the board. So uh, nice thin rails, but in the standing area you have a nice stable platform to put your feet on. And then another really nice feature is the deck pad. We have a super grippy deck pad. It has like this micro duct texture. Um, these little dots in here, are, um, it's a has some recycled content in it, so it's like an eco-friendly EVA deck pad. Uh, has like these beveled edges. And then here we have a section that has a little bit thinner deck pad where you, you don't need as much padding because you, we usually don't put your feet here as much. Uh, still really grippy, it's got these nice, uh, the Polynesian triangle design, and then the waves that kind of go along with our main logo up here. And then a the tail pad. We have a little arch support, arch bar, and then the tail kick, um, and then a little cutout in the back to keep it from, uh, you know, from, from coming off or also saving weight in the back here. So overall, these, the pads I'm super happy with. We also sell these pads as, a, as an accessory, so if you want to add the pads to a different board, we have these pads available. They're really awesome pad, deck pads. So on the bottom of the board, there's a slight concave in the nose, uh, going to flat and then to a V in the tail. So that kind of uh, allows the board to go rail to rail really easily and smoothly, dropping into waves easily. Um, nice combination of features and still forgiving. So, and the rail, a little bit softer in the front and then it gets sharp here towards the tail with, um, with higher rails in the back for a nice water release. And a little bit softer in the front so it doesn't catch your rail on your turns. 
Okay, so in terms of features, uh, this board has five fin boxes, comes with a three fin setup, set US center box, and then two side fins. You can also use it as a quad fin setup, um, so it has lots of fin options. And then on the deck, we have uh, double leash plugs in the back here. All the leash plugs and inserts are reinforced. We have our patented subgrip handle. It's a Blue Planet patent. Uh, it's super easy to grip. You can hold it like this. Any overhead, load it up on the car, super easy. Uh, it has like a rubber grip inside. And then the handle also has a vent plug integrated into the handle, so there's no separate installation of a vent plug that could potentially fail. So everything in this one handle. And then in the nose, we also install the FCS insert that you can use to mount a GoPro camera so you can film yourself surfing or just paddling. So it's sometimes a really good tool to, to see your technique. So it helps you improve your, your surfing and paddle technique. Okay, thank you so much for checking out our new boards. Hope you liked the video. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe to our Blue Planet Surf YouTube channel for more footage. And we'll see you on the water. Aloha.